congrats on the win tonight. They really struggled to defend you tonight despite throwing a number of looks at you. What did you see out there? Yeah, you know, they were showing, hedging, switching, helping. <laughs> I even think they threw a few zones at me a couple times, but no, I, I've seen all that in college. <laughs> well, it looked like it was really opening up both the lane and the outside shot. Yeah, that's our focus, you know. High efficiency shots. You know, if coach had his way, that's all he would shoot. And that's not always easy, obviously, but you know, that's the plan. You are still relatively new in this league, and, but you look like a veteran out there running the offense. Has the transition to the NBA been easier than you expected? Man, it definitely has not been easy. You know, it's a big leap, you know, from college to the NBA. But the franchise, the coach, my teammates have put, put me in a position to succeed. You know, they're going out their way to, you know, make sure my path is as smooth as possible. And thankfully, we're getting some results, man. So do you think your rookie struggles are over? <laughs> I wish, man. But not at all, you know. I'm sure there will be games where we don't shoot as well. Those assist numbers won't be there. You know, I'll probably have some turnovers in some games. But, you know, you got to take the good with the bad. Overall, I'm just happy where we are as a team. Not surprising after a performance like that. <laughs> Thanks, buddy. No doubt, brother. MP, what's up, uh -huh. bro? What up, what up? You looking good out there, man. Appreciate him. Hey, that's a nice pick right there. Hey, I can <laughs> know when I was wrong. And if I was wrong, that's what I'll be doing right now, admitting. <laughs> I thought you said I'd never be one of y'all. Look, it was true when I said it, but this new you, come you want on. an eye spot? Come on, come on. Whole different dude. I Whole get it, I dude. get it, I get it. You want a Gatorade, bro? I got you. Why not, why not? It's on the house. <laughs> My man, appreciate it, man. Thank you. Yo, one more thing before you leave. What's up? Could I, uh, get a selfie with you? Yeah, bro. I got you, man. <laughs> All right, cool. So we're going to take this on one. Oh, one. Cool. cool. So three, three, two, one. All right, man. I appreciate you. Lowe's of the crown. Hanging with my boy MP. Yes, sir. The team's in good hands. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Hashtag official team crown. Feel free to retweet that one. You don't mind. Oh, I got you, man. We good? Yeah, we good, bro. My oh, man. We good. See you around, brother. See you. Josh, what's going on, man? MP, how you doing? Bro, I'm chilling, man. I'm chilling. Yo, again, man, thank you for taking the time to see me, bro. That's love. Man, no problem. You know, I was in a similar situation last year, so I think I can help. Hold, hold on. Didn't you go top five last year? And the people loved you too, bro. Man, I went six, and yeah, a lot of people liked me, but there was also a lot of people who were shocked that I went that high, so especially on social media. Bro, man, tell me about it. Social media is so good, man. Man, that's what happens when it's all anonymous, I guess. Still, you see it all, and it affects you. All right, so, so, that's a good point you said. So, like, how do you deal with that doubt there? Well, I've always been someone who likes setting up teammates, helping them succeed. So, as long as my guys around me were thriving, I didn't really care what anybody said about me. Wait, but hold on. 
Like, you, you got to play well too, bro. It's not all about the team. Yeah, know? well, me playing well, my, you know, it means my guys are playing well around me. So that's just my game, and I can't really separate the two. Bro, you got the vision, man. You, you got the vision out there. You dropping them down. I see you. Yeah, I appreciate that. Look, I got to bounce, but it was nice talking to you, man. Hit me up if you ever want to hoop or you need any advice or whatever. All right, let's get it. Yo, MP, MP, give me something, what's up, what's up? Yo, check this out. I want to introduce you to somebody, but be cool, all right? It's Jake Duvall. I can see that, I can see that. Jake, my man. Hey, check this out. I want you to meet someone real quick. This is MP. Oh, yeah, right on. Nice what's going on, man? Uh, huge, huge, huge fan. Can't, I loved you in that, that Jewel Heist movie. Uh, can't can't shine forever. forever. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, let me tell you, that was a fun one. I'm not going to lie. I love you too. <laughs> yeah, what about that one movie you did? You, uh, the one guy, what's his name? Oh, he, uh, he, he did the other movie mm -hmm. with, with the guy, and they were like brothers and like related somehow. I know somehow. what you're talking about. Um, it was awesome though, yeah. either way. Thanks, man. I appreciate it. Hey, hang on a second. Yeah. Did you want a picture? Would you? Yeah, absolutely. Come on in. Stay. There you go. Looking good. Nice. <laughs> Thank you so, so much. Hey, if you want to I could take a photo for you. <gasps> oh, she's probably busy or something like that. <laughs> yeah. Jake, they love you around here, man. Yeah, honestly. Feelings mutual. I mean, I grew up around here, man. These are my yeah. people. Yeah, oh, I mean, we know all about that, oh, man. <laughs> must be nice, man. Listen, <clears throat> MP. Seriously, man. I've been a fan of this team my whole life, right? Mm -hmm. And I'm telling you, there's not one type of player that the fans are into, right? You could be shooting lights out, a defensive menace. It doesn't matter. Because what the people want is just someone who is authentically themselves. Someone who will do whatever they can, using whatever they got. Mm -hmm. To help the team win. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. <laughs> you could be a coach, man. You know what? You should play a coach. <laughs> Tell you what, I'll pass that one on to my agent. Look, guys, I gotta get back to this interview over here, okay? Yeah. MP, I know, man, there's a part of you, right? That just wants to show everyone you can out shap shap, but I'm telling you, that's a losing game, man. You gotta be yourself. I mean, if you say so. I'm telling you, these people, these fans, they can smell a phony a mile away. You gotta be yourself and you gotta lay it all out there mm -hmm. on the court mm -hmm. where they can see it. That's how you're gonna be the type of leader that fans can respect. Ooh, 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 you got me riled up, man. Oh, man. <laughs> Jake, thank you, man. Yeah, don't worry about it. Just keep working for the W's, okay? I'll see you guys around, man. Oh, see man. you later, my man, Jake. <laughs> yeah, you had a couple of questions for me? Come on, Jake. we can walk and talk. Yeah, Jake Duval, man, yo, is he not the best? Bro, like, First off, I've never seen you so starstruck before. <laughs> wait, 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 me? You, me. Yes. All right, look, I, I want to say nothing in front of him, but honestly, MP, look, come here. Come here. Look, if we're going to be in front of celebrities all the time, you're going to need to keep your emotions in check. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Keep them in check. That was embarrassing. Me. Did you see yourself? No, no, did you see your... I'm suave. <laughs> I'll work on it. Fine. Thank you.
Both teams tonight aren't afraid to run offense through their bigs, Grant. Talk about the value of being able to do that. Yeah, B.A., you know, it just needs to help. Anders is checked in for Minnesota. Prince comes in for Noel. And the Lakers making a change here. And so in the game for Los Angeles, they've got MP. Juan Toscano Anderson is out there with Thomas Bryant. Then it's Patrick Beverly. That's Davis in at the five. Minnesota has gone just two for six from the arc here in the first. Pass to Towns. Russell from outside. Not going to go that time. Now the Lakers take it the other way. That whistle blows. It's going to be on Anthony Ebers. That's his first foul. Russell Westbrook, he's checked in for Beverly. MP, the pass to Westbrook. Here's the screen by Bryant. Over Anderson. Edwards pulls it in. The Timberwolves have gone only three for nine for the floor. Towns, a screen on MP. Stolen by MP. And a big question mark for MP that he'll have to answer this year. Can his skills translate into NBA success? Yeah, he was a great college player. Nobody is arguing that. But many wonder if he'll be able to handle the physical side of the NBA. Hard to say just yet, but we'll find out soon enough. Back to Russell. To stop the run. On the take. And then Russell with the dunk. The speed of Russell on Full display. Love watching him turn on the Jets and get to the cup. Here's MP. Oh, nice finish for the low block. That one's good. And the Lakers lead by 13. Defensively, their effort hasn't been great early on. The three from Russell. He's off on that one. Now the Lakers take it the other way. They're coming off a win against the Nuggets. Yeah, they hit the court last game with some serious attitude, especially on offense. And they backed it up with their play, got protection from everyone, and they were able to walk the walk on the offensive end. Towns double team. Pass to Russell. And finished off by Anderson. And this is what point guards like Russell are responsible for, setting the table for his guys. Now Los Angeles with it. It's a 13-point game. Davis down low, covered by Towns. MP, a screen on Edwards. Here's Westbrook, and the Lakers tack on two more. And they've settled in quickly today. A nice flow and rhythm to their offense. Russell, the pass to Towns. Pass to Edwards. To the wing, right side. Shot clock at six. Anderson finds Edwards. That three's off the mark. And this is exactly who you want taking that shot. He just missed it. As for the Lakers, you think this is the last team LeBron plays for? You know, B.A., he certainly wants to play with his son. We know that. Now, whether that's in the purple and gold, only time will tell. 
it would definitely be fun to see them both with this storied franchise. Picked by Prince. From 10 Faye. Misses off the left iron. I'd like to see him a bit more efficient. He has not been great this quarter. Davis. That one's good. And the assist to Bryant. Davis has got his second bucket on the night. Boy, I like their energy coming in. <laughs> Terrific execution so far. Couldn't come up with a much better start than this. They just have to keep it going. The shot to stop the run. The shot by Russell, no good. This is the definition of forcing it. He's trying to get himself going, but taking tough shots just won't do it. Here's to Scano. And again, it's the Lakers. And <laughs> they've got the D reeling. A full three-point attack right off the tip. They're searching for a way to score. Yeah, buckets have been very tough to come by. Edwards with it, and Davis picks him up defensively. Chalk up two there. I like seeing Towns be aggressive from deep. He knows his teammates want him to shoot from there. And then Bryant with the dunk. Building a big advantage early with a terrific all-around performance. They got off to such a hot start, and that can keep you energized throughout the whole game. Back to Russell from the arc. Offensive rebound, Timberwolves. And powered home by Towns. Aggressive play by Towns on the glass. Recapturing possessions so he could take it right back up. Westbrook finds MP. To the middle. Here's Davis. And finished off by Davis. And although he's undersized at his position, his vertical, yeah, that'll clean up a few mistakes. 56 seconds left now in the first quarter. Russell against MP. Towns down low. He had 16 in the win against Antonio. Russell against MP. The shot by Russell, no good. Yeah, just hasn't been able to find his rhythm offensively. And that's having a ripple effect. From deep, MP. That's good. And so Westbrook with the assist. MP's got 12 points. And he's carried them this quarter. A dominant offensive stretch. One second separating the shot clock and the game clock. That one falls. Oh, defense is trying to get fiddled with Russell, but he has great body control and composure. Tough to throw him off game. Both free throws good from Davis. Davis definitely wants to be better from here. He knows that he can improve on his percentage from the line. Here's Russell. Davis with the defensive effort. Look, the defense was locked in on him there. They know how dangerous he can be, and they guarded him perfectly. And so it's... And if you're just tuning in, we've got a wide margin on the scoreboard, but plenty of time left for a comeback. All right, guys, what do you think so far on the offensive approach for Los Angeles? We've got Nas Reed. Kyle Anderson is out there with Torian Prince. Then it's Jalen Noel. And it's Edwards in at the two. So that's the lineup for Minnesota. Pass to Reed. Checked in for Prince. Here's a well. Floats one up, and he lays it up and in. Noel's got his first basket. The floater is so tough to defend against. Nothing defenders can really do but shake their heads. And that was the mobile one drive. Low resistance to the finish line. You're toasting the defense and getting in close. They'll take possessions like that one all day. He drops yet another dime, just facilitating this offense like a maestro. Edwards, a pass to Anton. And Bryant pulls it down. Bryant got more rebounds now. Something Kyle Anderson as well is put pressure on ball. Not what you expect from bigger guys, but he's got good instincts and fine steals. 
The Timberwolves shooting around 39%. They'd like to get that higher. Pass to Reed. James brings the double team. Here's Noel. No good with the triple. His ability to snatch the ball has even helped him secure a record, Richard. Yeah, back in 2021, Kyle set the single-game playoff record for the Grizzlies with six steals. What an impressive defensive effort for him, and trust me, he knows how to use his size and length very well. A minute and a half gone in the second quarter. It's James on the wing. Six to shoot. Back to MP. The Lakers got to get one up. Late clock. Here's Reeves. Cash. It's MP picking up the assist. MP's got four assists in the game. Offensively, it's been a struggle for him. Yeah, they need to string together some shots to have any kind of chance. Noel drives in over James. Ooh, and once again, off the mark by Minnesota. They really have a commanding lead, not just in points, but in rebounds. Well. Straight four out of five. In the paint, LeBron James is capable of running right over the defender. That is athletic. Pass to Edwards. Reed to screen on Walker. Here's Edwards. And Edwards slams it in. Come on now, guys. That's flat out insane. Hey, when's the last time you saw a jam like that? Impressive looks on the AT&T 5G slam cam. Good on the bucket. And he's made his mark on offense especially. They got to be thankful he's on their squad. Reed with it. Driving inside. Good on the shot. Reed's got his first two points of the night. Nice ball movement there. Delivered the pass right on time. Hey, D up on LB. And the shot counts. That's he's good. There are high school reps better than you guys. Rudy Gobert's checked in for the Timberwolves. Well, the Timberwolves struck gold by getting the number one pick in the 2015 and 2028 drafts. You are so right, B.A., selecting Carl Anthony Towns and Anthony Edwards, respectively. Two important players that already had a tremendous impact on this team. Gobert. And just so mobile at his size. Once Gobert sets the screen, he rolls hard to the right spot. Here's James. Yes, sir, and it's Bryant picking up the assist. James has got nine points now in the quarter. Edwards against Walker. Edwards, the pass to Reed. Shoots over Bryant. Reed can't hit. Really thought he had this one, and the defense, they were giving it to him. And he comes up with a bucket. James has got 19 points. They're finding ways to get the ball into the paint. Five consecutive buckets. McDaniels from long range. Rebound by the Lakers. Bryant's got six rebounds here tonight. And right now, they're plus eight in the rebounding category. That's helping them run away with this. The three, James. And the Lakers hit again from deep. Nice start for him beyond the arc. He's already hit three triples, and I'm pretty sure there's more to come. Pass to Gobert. And they double up Gobert. Tipped away. It's McDaniels on the wing. Another miss at Minnesota. And he might have thrown himself off when he saw how much space he had three. Inside. Here's James. Oh, he is cooking right now. 10 for 11 from the field. <laughs> They're not messing around. Five of their last six buckets have come from the interior. Reed to screen on Walker. Edwards, the pass to Gobert. Back to Edwards. Reed sets a screen. Ooh, and once again, off the mark by Minnesota. Los Angeles has got it going from deep. Three for three so far in the quarter. MP, the pass to Walker. Here's MP. That falls. Nice feed that time from James. He's got 19. More points coming from inside. In that respect, they've been the more aggressive team. Gobert is doubled. And we're going to have a jump, jump, jump ball. Jump, jump ball. You two. Yeah. 
Back to Noel. To end the drought. Unable to get that one. And Los Angeles the other way now. Next up on the schedule, the Nuggets. A home game. That game marks the start of a four-game homestand for the club. Here's James. He gets it in there. James has got 26. Well, part of the game plan was to neutralize the crowd. And guess what? Mission accomplished. Oh, yeah, they're doing a terrific job not giving this NFL crowd anything to cheer about. And despite the height just... Really unfazed. And so it's Bon James making things happen for the Lakers. Hit a couple from downtown this quarter. We'll be right back. And welcome LeBron James in the spotlight again. He has been getting it done. Well, he's in the zone shooting it. Every time he puts up the three, he believes it's going in. Trust me, that's a great feeling. People ask, what's it like to be in the zone? I don't know. You just feel it. The game just slows down. It's like you can do no wrong. Changing things up now. Let's take a glance at the upcoming schedule. And that game against the Spurs... This one should be very informative. We'll just see how even these teams are. The rankings might not tell the whole story. Projections mean nothing to me. Thanks for tuning in. Now we head back to Brian Anderson for the start of the quarter. Just about ready for the second half here. A big comeback is needed for this game to be competitive, and it probably has to happen quickly. You know, LeBron James has been exceptional. Los Angeles. So it's the Lakers now. And he was fouled while in the act of shooting. There are high school refs better than you guys. Way better. And you hear from a lot of coaches nowadays threatening drives. What's the value of breaking the paint? VA, dribble penetration is so important, particularly in today's game. With the spacing and the great shooting on the perimeter, if you can get to the paint, one, you may score at the rim, but if the defense collapse, now you have an opportunity to find an open shooter. They need something good to happen here. Yeah, they're going way too long without a score. And so in the game for Los Angeles, Dave's out there with Ersan Ilyasova. Then it's MP. Then there's LeBron James. And it's none in at the one. They've shown the power inside. Their rebounding effort has been sensational. Kicks it out to MP. Ilyasova with the bucket. And trust me, when the D's slow to react, he'll be the first guy to make them pay. Yeah, they're going to do a much better job of putting a little bit of pressure on him on his way to the hoop. Pass to Towns. Now here's Edwards. Just five to shoot. Back to Towns. LeBron with a rebound. See, that miss, that miss right there. It's why teams try to avoid the mid jumper these days. Let's check in with our reporter, Ali LaForce. Well, the league and the world have endured tremendous pain. said, quote, we found a way to keep going under very difficult circumstances. It required enormous diligence to keep playing throughout the pandemic. We are particularly proud of that. Brian? Hey, the show must go on. Thanks, Ali. And the Timberwolves making a change here. Reed's checked in, and the Lakers also making a switch. Walker, he's checked in for none. Back to Reed. Looking to win the drought. Another miss by Minnesota. Los Angeles is going to 0 for 2 from outside here on third. Leosova, left side. 
MP, the pass to Davis. Russell against James. That's in there. Davis with the assist. Davis has got his third assist of the night. That was another look at our mobile one drive of the game just a moment ago. You know, B.A., even with the game well in control, he can right at the rim. I love it. It's blocked. And that one goes out of bounds. Last touch by James. And oh well. The Lakers also with a sub. Reeves is checked in. Down low. Here's Russell. And he drops in the layup off the glass. Russell's gotten four this quarter. Yeah, inside the paint, Russell stays so nimble, helping him get such a high percentage look. Here's MP. Shots blocked. And they recover it. Shots good by James. Clutch buckets. He's even way as they hit the home stretch. Pass to Russell. Let's the three fly. Rebound, the Lakers. Davis has got rebound number eight here already in the game. Here's all you need to know about how talented Anthony Davis was as a young player. He was invited to play for the U.S. national team when he was a college freshman. Just so successful getting the ball inside and finding those great looks. High post read. And it's blocked by Davis. And this is how AD led the league in block shots. It's not just his wingspan, but it's his awareness, his basketball IQ when it comes to beating the game. Prince has checked in for Gobert. Puts up the inbound. Here's Russell. And the shot is good off the backboard. Russell's got 18 points in the game. I love his tenacity. Extra possessions, second chance points. That's winning basketball. Buries it from three. 81 gold with Team USA in London in 2012. Richard, he was the only college player on the team. With all of that pressure and intensity, it probably gave AD a great taste of what life was going to be like in the NBA. Reed passes to Edwards. Reed to screen on Walker. There's Edwards. Oh, and he got fouled on his way up. Points are coming from here for Los Angeles. McLaughlin, he's checked in for the Timberwolves. Bryant, he's checked in for the Lakers. Well, one thing you learn about Anthony Edwards, he does not lack for confidence. He wants to become the best to ever do it, and he believes he can. Since halftime, they have been efficient and effective, making Coach very happy. I could sum that to their communication on the floor. They are attacking as a unit. Anderson passes to Reed. No luck on that one. Good work defensively by James. And you see the ambition for greatness in Edwards. But, Grant, is he willing to do the work? Well, B.A., think about this. He's a quick study. He listens to his coaches with curiosity. And he's driven to achieve the goals they set for him. Yeah, I think he can. In today's game, you can never afford to get beat in the three-point battle. Minnesota has gone two of six from downtown here in the second half. High post read. To the paint. Here's Prince. Oh, and a beautiful feed leads to a monster jam. And one move out of the defense. A solid pick. And then the monster dunk to completely play. Well done. Oh, great chemistry on this play. He under the mirror to put the screen in order to free up his teammate. Edwards with it. He's got 12. Pass to McLaughlin. High post read. Six on the shot clock. James brings the double team. And a bit of a battle for the ball. And the officials signal a jump ball here. Here's Anderson. And Bryant pulls it down. Bryant's got 11 rebounds in the game. MP the pass to Walker. Good. And the assist goes to MP. Walker's got himself going here. His first points of the game on the deep ball. Pass to Edwards. Now here's Reed. Checked by James. 
Edwards against Walker. Back to Reed. Nice assist and nice finish. Solid play all the way around. He finds a shooter in motion and is confident he can thread him with the lead pass. Well done. And then Bryant with the dunk. You have to be accurate there. Very little room for error passing on the interior. And for Minnesota, they're shooting 37% since the beginning of the third quarter. Pass to Anderson. To the inside. And the layup is good off the glass. Anderson's gotten his second bucket. He's good enough where it takes a lot to bother him at the rim like that. Here's James. And he drops it in from the low post. Like at this point in time, like you have to understand that if LeBron James is on the inside, he has so many ways to beat you. A little contact's not going to do anything. Reed finds Anderson. Reed sets a screen. Oh, and Brian with the block. Here's Walker. And there's another one for the Lakers. And from the mid-range area, they've been the more effective team. Minnesota. So it's gone two of six from downtown here in the second half. Pass to Reed. Back to Edwards. And Bryant pulls it down. Bryant's got 12 rebounds here tonight. Big time effort. Edwards against MP. Back to Walker. Over to the wing. Here's Reeves. Yes. Great play by Walker to set it up. Walker's got three assists now in this one. Slow defensive rotation causing a breakdown along the perimeter. Reed to screen on MP. Pass to Reed. They need this. Rebounded by the Lakers. And with his team try trim the margin, his struggles this yeah, they're not helping things. Here's MP. Oh, they find the hot hand. You can count it. He's 10 for 14 now. They're really dictating the tempo on both ends of the court. You love it. And guys, to go on a big run, get some breathing space. It has to be a great play on each end. Back to Anderson. From outside the arc. Walker pulls down the board. Los Angeles has gotten 12 of their points this quarter from deep. Four of six. Let's go with a three. And the Lakers hit again. From deep. This is what it's been since halftime. Remarkable results from downtown. In the modern NBA, you have to hit threes to win games. And they've made that adjustment since the break. Another mid by Minnesota. It's obvious to be coming frustrated. Nothing seems to be going their way. In a major drought, need to find some sort of momentum. The Timberwolves shooting just 37% in the game. Pass to Edwards. Reed against James. Stolen by MP. Fast break. Here come the Lakers. Picked it out of midair. Here's Prince. He's at five. Now Reed. Covered by MP. Fade away. Rebound. The Lakers. Bryant got 14 rebounds tonight. Go on after it. More than a few bad breaks for his quarter. He's struggling and the team is following on the scoreboard and the shot goes in MP's got 28 and he couldn't get an easier shot the defense right now just looks defeated yeah you'd love to see a little bit more fire on defense shoot any fire on defense they can't just be giving the game away and so it's the Los Angeles Lakers showing no <laughs> running their sets well Checking Reed. Towns comes in for Ellaby. Anderson's checked in for more. And Prince is subbed in for Forbes. RJ, you played with some of the greats. LeBron, Duncan, Dirk, Jason Kidd, just to name a few. But if the game were on the line, who would you want taking the last shot? Put you on the spot. 
I'm going to be really honest. I have been in great situations with all of those guys, and they have all delivered. So this isn't, but I'm going to go with the person that's delivered the biggest shot of my career, and that was Kyrie Irving. He hit the clutchest shot in NBA history. Argue with if you want. You're going to lose it. No argument here. Down plays the floor with Gobert in the middle. Aiden McDaniels out there with Torian Prince, and it's Anderson at the three. So that's the lineup for Minnesota. Davis, Cash, it's MP picking up the assist. MP's got assist number 11 for him here tonight. 136 left in the fourth. Pass to Prince. McDaniels up top. He can't get that one to fall. And Los Angeles, the other way now. Well, the scoreboard tells you everything you need to know about this one. A great showing here for the Lakers. And everything seemed to go their way today. They were firing on all cylinders, Grant. Yeah, B.A., this is the kind of performance you relish as a player. Just a very impressive win. And it's a performance that will signify their fifth win of the year. And having this win on the books might give them a little mental advantage the next two times these squads meet. And when you look at the game, the one thing that helped fuel the team to victory was the efficiency for LeBron James. We saw him get a lot of touches, and he wasted very few of them. Really makes a backbone of their offense. Here's MP, and it's Gobert with a rebound. Outside, Anderson. Pass to Prince. Fires the three. Here's Towns. And Towns! at home <laughs> look at towns asserting himself inside he knows he can muscle his way to a shot anytime and that replay courtesy of the AT&T 5G slam cam and the Lakers have possession there's a four second difference from the shot clock and the game clock MP shot is off the three is up rebound that is from deep, MP sends it home from three-point land. MP's got 33. They really came in with the right mindset today. I can guarantee you their flight home will be filled with some smiles. And as it should be. Yeah, like but when you go home, you're going to go home feeling good. And so it's the Lakers easily grabbing this one. Boy, this crowd has to be shocked by the way their team was dismantled. Now, shocked and surprised. It doesn't matter what the matchup is. You never expect a road team to just waltz in and cruise to the type of victory like we saw tonight. And that about wraps it up. This is Brian Anderson saying thanks for tuning in. We'll see you next time. An interesting bit of news today about the ongoing Shep Owens MP drama. Nate White of the Daily Horn reports that the Los Angeles Lakers have requested MP, their controversial 18th pick, participate in a PR initiative to win over skeptical fans. So no word yet on what exactly they have in mind to accomplish this goal, but J.J. Perk, what do you think of the notion that MP needs to win over this fan base with off-the-court activities? And here we are. It's more evidence of an organization in disarray. The reason fans booed MP is because he's not as good at basketball as Shep. 
These are some of the smartest fans in the game. You're not going to win them over with a PR stunt. For once, I agree with you, Perk. Wow. For once. Maybe I should rethink this. <laughs> <laughs> no, seriously, though, I'm, I'm all for getting involved in the community. Every pro athlete should give back. Amen. That's right. But, but if this team thinks MP can make the Shep comparisons go away by being a good guy off the court, they're in for a rude awakening. At the end of the day, NBA fans want wins. If MP plays winning basketball, they'll love him. If he doesn't, no one of PR is going to change their minds. JJ, JJ, for once, you're speaking my language. Thank you. You're welcome. And I'll tell you one more thing. This young man needs to put in work. Leave him alone and let him hoop. Enough is enough already. Uh, we don't know what they asked him to do, so I'm not going to be right. too critical here, but I agree that basketball needs to be his main focus going forward. Preach. If he's going to change this city's mind, he's going to do it with results, not promises. That was refreshingly cordial, fellas. Don't get used to this, <laughs> You got it, big perk. Coming up, trade rumors. It's never too soon to speculate. But first, this quick commercial break. MP, you got a minute? Yeah, what's up? Over here. What's this I hear about you working on some win the city initiative? Look, man, I've been meaning. I thought to... I was clear with you. Basketball comes first. End of story. I, it does. But I got a lot of people in my ear telling me I got to do other stuff too, man. What, Freddy? What did I tell you about him? No, I know what you said about it, but just because you don't like him doesn't mean he's going to disappear. I told you. You talk to me if he gives you a hard time. He's not giving me a hard time, Othello. The things that I do outside of the court does not distract me from what I need to do on the court or for this team. I need you focused. I am focused. You are a critical building block for the future of this franchise. I get it. And I appreciate it. I really, really do. But you gotta really trust me on this one. Because I got this. Adam's on the line for you. I... I'm serious. Let me know if Freddy gives you problems, here. Yeah? I promise you. You'll be the first one to know. All right, I'm going to hold you to that. Give me the... Adam! <laughs> it's been too long, bro. <laughs> Hey, everyone. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Let's stop my man Nate Dog right here. What do you say to the people who question the wisdom of your decision to participate in a PR offensive to win over the hearts and minds of the city? Well, first of all, I wouldn't phrase it like that, Nate. A uh, PR offensive to win over the hearts and mind of the city. I mean, it makes it sound like I'm dropping propaganda pamphlets out of an airplane or something. Bro, all I'm trying to do is help the people in my community and get to know them better. That's it. <laughs> well, listen, you know, I don't question your desire to support your community. <laughs> but like but what, I've, I, I, what I've reported on is much more sophisticated than a simple desire to help. I mean, it seems a little... Uh, how do you say, uh, calculated? <laughs> okay, well, I'm the kind of guy that takes a very systematic approach to everything that I do. So I ask for the team's help on this because they've been part of this community for a long time, you know? And they have roots here, and I thought that it may be able to help me establish a relationship with the fans. You know, it's not some sort of evil scheme that's going on here. You know, I just know that if I want to accomplish something, I need to set a goal for myself. Simple as that. I mean, okay. Well, that's fair enough. I'm just asking questions here, MP. 
Well, that's just one way to put it. Well, okay. Well, how would you put it? <laughs> you know, man, it feels like you're trying to stir up some drama right now. But honestly, I'm not even mad about it, because that's your job. So I'll give you that. But it doesn't mean I'm not going to st not stand up for myself, though. You know, I'm not built that way and never have been. So you'll see for yourself soon enough. <laughs> okay. Okay. You got it. Okay, that's it. All right. Thanks, guys. Well, you guys played really well for all four quarters tonight. What was the key to putting together a complete performance? Yeah, it sounds simple, but like, sometimes the key is just making shots. You know, this game is a lot easier when the ball is going through the hoop. Tonight I saw a couple shots fall early and I just started to flow from there. My teammates started to look for me and I was able to get it done. <laughs> Yes, you were. I mean, that was one of the most impressive scoring nights of your rookie season so far. Do you feel like you're figuring out this league? Thanks, Candace. Listen, I, I didn't even know how many points I had. I don't know about figuring things out. This league will humble you real fast if you let it. You know, I'm just trying to grind and just get better every day. That's it. Right on. Good job, champ. Appreciate it. Good game tonight. It looks like your coach is getting a lot more comfortable with the ball being in your hands. What did you see out there tonight? <laughs> Thanks, Candace. Um, defense threw a lot of looks at us tonight. You know, I was just really just trying to avoid the trap and keep the ball moving. You know, we know we have the advantage in transition. So now we got the boards, you know, we just tried to keep our head up and look for a teammate early in the shot clock. Well, what does this performance say about the kind of talent you guys have on offense? Man, it says this squad is stacked. Like, no joke. You know, we've got a cast that can ball from 1 to 15. You know, my job is to facilitate their success. I'm still learning, you know, but as you can see, you know, we're getting better and this is only the beginning. <laughs> That's right. Nice work. Thank you. Thank you.